In this segment, we're going to cover installing the brick molding for the right side of the door trim. Um, I'm going to give you a little tip. With a piece of your scrap, cut uh, one top piece with the inverted 45 degree angle for the right side, and then cut another one for the left side. This way, when you're installing your vertical board, you make sure you've got your height set correctly so your 45s will come together. If you hold them together, you can use this little board to determine your proper setting, and that will ensure you get a good fit when we cut the top piece. Now once we've got it located, I'll put a couple clamps on there to hold it in place and then we'll nail it in with a uh, pneumatic nail gun. Okay, I've got it clamped and what we want to do is nail it in and uh, we want to stay to the outside because we've got that mounting flange that comes out in one and one eighth of an inch. And I don't know if you can see the gap, there's a crown in this board which means it's bowed and there's a space in here. So what we'll do is start nailing at one end and make sure we hold it tight to the door all the way down so we get a good tight fit. Now, if you have the accessibility to get into it with the gun, if you see the notch, when you shoot it this way, you get a, a, a the nail head vertical. If we run that horizontal the same direction as a the grain of the wood is easier to fill and doesn't leave as big a hole. But that doesn't always uh, allow you to do so by different angles and situations you're in. Uh, it's just a, a easier putty fix for our painting and final application finishing. Okay, that'll conclude this segment on installing the uh, brick molding right side. Please watch our next segment and we'll cover installing the brick molding left side.